What is laparoscopic cholecystectomy? Laparoscopic cholecystectomy involves the removal of the gallbladder through a laparoscopic approach. How is this procedure done? In the operating room under general anesthesia, a small needle is inserted into the navel to allow inflation of the abdomen with gas. A telescope is inserted through a small 10 millimeter hole or port inserted in the navel to allow visualization. A second hole is placed just under the breastbone in the middle of the abdomen. Two small ports are placed in the right side of the abdomen to allow for retraction. The gallbladder is then freed of any scar tissue which may be present from previous episodes of acute cholecystitis. A small incision is made either in the gallbladder itself or in the cystic duct to allow insertion of a small tube or catheter. Dye is injected through this catheter to allow visualization of the ducts and to ensure that no stones are present within the bile duct on an x-ray screen. If there are no stones present in the bile duct, the cystic duct is divided after sealing it with metallic clips. The cystic artery is clipped and divided and the gallbladder is removed from the bed of the liver with a cautery device or laser. The gallbladder is then removed through one of the small incisions and the ports are closed. The patient is able to eat immediately after waking from surgery and is usually discharged home that day or the next. Most patients return to normal activity within one to two weeks of their procedure. Who is a candidate for this procedure? Not everyone is a candidate for laparoscopic cholecystectomy. You and your doctor should decide what is best for you.